it's easy during an emergency to give money, but the question is what more can we do as a community? And we're really happy to say that one of the results of that was we now have 15 foundations or other donors who since Ebola in 2014, we've had a teleconference every single month where we share what we're all doing and what areas, and we've mapped out a strategic plan of what it's going to take to end pandemics, whether it means you're focused on vaccines, you're focused on drugs, you want to do first responders, we want to do surveillance. We at least now know what everybody's doing, and we try to collaborate on things where nobody's doing something and we can work together. Um, but I think most importantly, we've now twice a year got together in person and had real strategic conversations about big ideas and risky things that maybe if we pulled some of that risk, none of us singly uh, you know, may want to take that on, but together you know, it may be possible.